Hello, welcome back to another unboxing. MG, MTG Bros, what's up? We're doing we're doing another Ixalan number two box. Number five box was good. We're hyped. Whenever you d when the boxes are good, you just want to keep on going. When the boxes are bad, you you give up. Well, I mean, like, if the boxes are bad, and they're continuously bad, do you open more, or do you just go, okay, they're all going to be bad? Well, so we... There's a thing called a sunk cost fallacy. Oh, yeah? It's a gambler's theory. If you, ever, you ever heard of it? Yeah. I've heard of it. So we're going to put that there. We'll open at the end, just because... The last one was decent, so we got another dinosaur mat out for, because we're hoping for some good dino poles. All right, dino tam, dino taman. What the heck is this? Dino, dino, denominate. What? Okay, forget it. I cannot read. Mountain. We got belligerent yearling, bedrock tortoise. Sunken Citadel, From the Rubble, Hulking Raptor, and Compi Swarm. If anyone knows which one this is, let me know, because I do. We got the Jurassic Park trivia on this channel. It's a good one. Yeah. He, um, he pretty much was... um. He used that like a stun thing to like mess with the compies because they were harmless. Basically, because they never seen human before, so they weren't scared of humans. So then he shocked them with it. And then when he went on like um, because there's like a buddy system, you're supposed to go to the bathroom and tell your buddy. He told someone he was going to the bathroom, but they were they had headphones on, they didn't hear him, so they left him. He fell down a ravine. Compies ate him. Yummy. They're harmless. This guy again, Swamp Thing. Ooh, that's a cool card. Bringer of the Last Gift. That's a mythic. No, it's a rare. Hard to see. Whoa, Corpse of the Lost. Good art. Wrathful. And then Throne. And then a, a Jank Jurassic Park card. Very quiet. Yep. Alright, we got the ATOG. Breach. Unstable Glyph. Sun Flavor. Restless Vents. Ian Malcolm. Yeah, Ian. Nice. Ian Malcolm. He's a couple bucks. Sacralite Stalker. He's the guy that says life finds a way. What is it? He's like some, like, they call him a like chaos. Theorist. Okay, What's his quote on the bottom of the card? It's. Oh, it's. You all heard of Chaos Theory? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That's the part where um he puts the water droplet on the girl's hand, the back of the girl's hand, mm. while they were um in the car near the Triceratops cage. The first one? Yeah. Who's the guy who gets eaten in the border That's the that's the lawyer. Cavern of Souls. Cavern of Souls. That's mine. Thanks. Dude, you got this one, right? Swooping Pteranodon. That's cool. I got two of them. And um this one is from I think that's Jurassic World. Eating a kid. Yep. Rampaging Ceratops again. Then we got Deep Fathom Echo. Subterranean. Schooner Dinosaur Egg. Oh, that's cool. Breachless Pilfer. That's a monkey. Oh, it's a goblin. Uh, Welcome to... Oh, this... A that's a good one. That's one of the top ones. Welcome to... And Get Lost. Whoa, that's a cool foil. Get Lost. The last foil looks cool. Didn't you get one? I think you got one. Last pack of the left. 
And I only got one mythic. That's not good. And we got card damage right there. Dude, my cards are getting damaged. Damaged. Yeah. Welcome to us, 25 bucks. Nice. Belligerent Yearling with the print line. The art is pretty cool, actually. If they would make that into a bigger art. Which one? Welcome to. Oh, yeah. We got some jank mythic. Oh, well, hey, that's a good one. Roaming Throne. Yeah, that's one of the top rares. Okay. It's like 10 bucks. 10 bucks, okay. Oh, Indoraptor, sweet. Indoraptor. I'll put this to the side Roaming like that. Roaming Throne is 13. The Whoa, the Skullpore Nexus mythic foil. Oh, yeah, that's a, good, that's a good one. You said, what's Roaming Throne? Did I even get that? Why'd Nexus foil is 15. Okay, that's good. Nice. Swamp thing. Poetic ingenuity. I feel like there's a lot of decent value in the box. Mm -hmm. Bringer the of the last gift. You're not gonna be like fifty dollar box, ah. I hope. Unless yeah, there's not going to be a fifty dollar, so like like that pack. If all your packs are like that, you're going to strike out. Yeah, but that seems. There seems to be a lot of places where you could hit something. Exactly. You know? As long as the value holds. Okay, so we got the nizz. My pal just <laughs> fell. Soul cleaver again. I got one of those. We got a. Hatcher and what's the Jurassic Park? Bam! Planes. What a lame. That is bad. We've got like four packs left. Let's go. Come on. Okay, Thousand Moon Smitty. Smithy. Abu Abuelo's Awakening. Gem Cutter. Restless Pipeline or Ridgeline. And Island. Come on. We got a Thrasian hero. We got three packs left. This is bad. This is bad. We need something big. Come on. Raptor, cool card. Okay, we got Chemo, the inner sun. Deep Fathom Echo. Whoa, that looks like a weird card. Is this a Ore? Cosmic Catalyst. Abuelo. Whoa. Savage Order. You got that before. Restless Vents. Two more. Come on. Give me a give me something. Give me something. Make this worth it. I mean you're still low on mythics. We got the hammer skull. Treasure map. Arm. Oh, we got the Oger. Patapa Deep Epa. Command Tower Lame. Oh, Growing Rights of the Italomic. Come on. Oh my god. That is bad. That is bad. Okay, uh, Atog again. The Belligerent again. Threefold Thunder. Hunk of Junk. Don't move. Cool. It's a different card. And then Trumpeting Carna Carnosaur. Is this good? Did you say a carnosaur is good? Trumpeting carnosaur yeah. is very good. Let's With a print see. line. With a what? It's a print line on it. Oh, I thought you didn't have the stamp on it. We would. That's about like 12 bucks. That's good? That's, That's horrible. Good. I probably have like 100 bucks here. That's not bad. I think you probably got more. That's gonna be it. That's gonna be it. We get stamp card. Can you get stamp cards in these? Oh. Yeah, the Jurassic Park stamp card. Can you get it in the, the, these packs? Yeah, less than one percent of the packs. But this is a, a box topper. Oh. No. All right, this is gonna be the hundred dollar card. Whoa, chromatic ori. Mythic. Let me see. Let me see. That's a good one. Give me some money, please. Twenty-five bucks. 
Okay, that's. Dude, how come I get lousy on comments and you get like these top cards? I don't know because they feel they feel sorry for me. So the third top, the top card is Chalice of the Wind, and then there's gonna be Tamil the Inner Sun, and then Amulet Vigor, and then Chromatic Ori. So oh, we got, so I got three and four already. Nice. Must be nice. I I'm pretty happy that um the the cards I got some that I didn't get. And it looks like you do get one mythic. I mean not one mythic, one foil. So I got lucky on the other one. Uh, the my foil was um the, the Raptor. Yeah. Souping Pteranodon. Ian, Malcolm. Pretty cool. Yeah, this makes me want to open more because I want the Jurassic Park cards. Collect all of them. Yeah. Seventy-five. There's seventy-five. Oh, I don't know. But then the other cards have good value. I mean, we're a little low on the mythic count here, but we did get Cavern of Souls, Chromatic Ori. This next is, you know, I mean, this is probably a hundred bucks here. We might have gotten some good stuff here, maybe one fifty-ish. I think. Anyways, even though this was not the best box you still get value because the Jurassic Park cards a lot of them are five ten bucks or more and then you can hit on the box topper which is actually a box topper not just random junk cards not to mention all the other cards in the normal set so I think so far I will say this is good value um but I still think a collector should have right here I don't think the lands are anything oh you mean like Jurassic Park lands yeah that I believe yes and did you know I was just looking up stuff Godzilla like Akoria I think in Japan or something has Godzilla lands it is it'll be like a mountain and Godzilla's like on the mountain it's pretty cool I, I might get some but yeah that's cool Anyways, um, if you're on the fence or you're thinking about it, I think this is a good set to get. The collectors do have value. Um, and we haven't opened a box out of the the ones that we opened. None have been lower than 100. And I think that's a win. Because um, recent sets... We have been, we were getting $50 boxes, you know, so, um, if uh, you, dude, I'm going to send you a card, mm -hmm. hilarious, dude, Can Jack, you take care of what's up right now? Jack, cool. all right, yeah, right yeah, now? I just got, uh, yeah, I saw that one, ha, <laughs> that's, um, that's the scene after he got, um, Jack, he got, um, you know the T-Rex scene? Yeah. He got out of the car, and he was swinging the, the, he was swinging the flare, and then he got, like, tail whacked, uh -huh. and then I think this is, like, after they brought him back to the, the main building. He's injured, pretty much. You can't see, but um, it was the Ian yeah. Convalescent Charmer <laughs> card. Yeah. But th these artists did a good job. So, really cool. Really cool art. And you know what I was hoping when the Ixalan um, playmats came out? I was hoping they would have Jurassic Park playmats. Yeah. But they didn't. I don't know if they will in the future. They should. But I was going to get some, and they didn't have any. So that was kind of disappointing. Yep. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging. Um, we got some more stuff to open, so stay tuned. And keep and, on cracking. And keep on cracking.